Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Let's close our eyes for prayer. Almighty God, you are already coming in the person of your son Jesus. And you have raised up this movement to bring Christians together as long as we believe you, accept your word. Because the church is one. God is one. Heaven is one. The Holy Spirit is one. The body of Christ is one. Oh Lord. Take the power of segregations among us in Jesus' name. Amen. All those proud ministers, all those evil ministers, false ministers that are dividing your church for themselves, God block them from your church in Jesus' name. Raise up pictures that will unite your church in righteousness and holiness. Raise up pictures of truth that will explain this doctrine and make it so clear that everybody will come together to serve the Lord. Thank you for this meeting in this city. The Lord bless the people. The Lord magnify himself. Jesus appeared to the seeing of the people. Jesus in Jesus' name we pray. We can be seated. I am talking to you on zealous of good works. Ana ma wagi okuni so kunkenasi inwe onono kunobi na inwe zolo. Zealous of good works. Onono kunobi inwe zolo. In the book of Titus, chapter 2. Akuko Titus isi abo. Verse 11 to verse 14. Titus chapter 2 verse 11. Titus is a To verse 14. For the grace of God that bringeth salvation hath appeared to all men. Teaching us that denying ungodliness and worldly lusts, we should live soberly, righteously, and godly in this present world. Looking for that blessed hope and the glorious appearing of the great God and our Savior, Jesus Christ. Who gave himself for us? That he might redeem us from all iniquity and purify unto himself a peculiar people, zealous of good works. The grace of God has appeared to all men that are living in this present world. The grace of God has appeared to all people that are living in this city. 
amarachi ne ke ne onye nsopota apota go he go si onwe nye ndini ne bi na oka the grace of god that brings salvation has appeared to all your relations amarachi ne ke nke ne we ten sopota i go si onwe puti he nye ndini ne bu mu nne gi no mu nna gi this grace is like the sun in the sky that is shining over all the members of your family Amara de kanya wu nke na etie na ototu obetu tandi ni de bu ndezi no logging it is shining over all the people that are in this country ana amu nye ndi ni de nke no na ala anyi gba gburuguru abanya ga epi no is there any part of the world that doesn't know the song enwara ga kumbu ana ama ga ihe na abanya wu is there any country that the sun in the sky is not known enwara mbu wo obula ama ga ihe na abanya wu So there is no tribe of people there is no race of people there is no nation of people there is no society of people that does not have the grace of god odi aburo abola odi gimbo abola odi asso abola ike madu bi ke ha magi maka mara chine ka ine and you that are hearing me you're seated here now you're there outside standing The grace of God has appeared to you also. Ki onye na nu olumu ugwa, obeze ni no kwa nezi ma onore bi na azo ya ma nu lo ka ka gi. Iye na wo bu na amara chineke apota wo ehe we enye gi. This grace of God is unto salvation. Amara bu nso puta ka ona aroputa nye mmadu ni ile. What does it mean by the grace of God? Gi ni kan ka putara ba amara chineke. It means the love of God. Asugaria ya ihe obutabu ihu na anya nke ichineke God is looking for someone to love among men among women among children Chineke na acho onye oge egosi ihu na anya na etiti ndi ikum na etiti ndi inyom na kwa etiti omutakiri God is looking for a wonderful opportunity of your life to pour his love upon you. Chineke na cho ohoroma puriche nyendo iko we wu sagi honanya ya. It's not only you, I say everyone that is alive in this present world. Abogi na nigi kama nye onye obona bu mkuru bi kana ekume na eluwa. The Bible says I stand at the door and knock I am looking for someone to love. I am looking for someone I would draw close to my heart. I am looking for someone I will care for. I am looking for someone that I will pour my smile upon him, upon her. That's what the word of God is saying. In John chapter 14. Apuko John isiri na no. Verse 21 to verse 24. Ayiro kunke iri abo na otu, re na nke iri abo na no. John chapter 14. Apuko John isi iri na no. Verse 21. Si malite na ayiro kunke iri abo na otu. He that hath my commandments and keepeth them, he it is that loveth me, and he that loveth me shall be loved of my Father, and I will love him and will manifest myself unto him. Onye nke na edebe iwum, onye nke na edebe kwa oku nile ya kam na honanya, onye nke na honanya ya bo kam na na hupa nanya. Can you see the God of heaven, the great being called God, the one that originated all things, said, I want to love someone. I'm looking for people to love. Can I get people that are fascinated in me that appreciate me that are keeping my word i want to know those people because i want to love them agama enweta wu ndi horom nanya agama enweta wu ndi re enwe mosu na ebe no achoro mi hu ndi de otu a ni na achom ka ngosi na ihu nanya can i get people that want to follow me that want to serve me that want to keep my word i want to see those people i want to love them nge enweta wu ndi nke ga acho ka ha de bi rum ndi ga ekwu ka ha we sorom ndi de otu a achoro ka ha gosi buto nwa achoro ka mu ha nanya 
in verse 23 Jesus answered and said unto him if a man love me he will keep my word and my father will love him and we will come unto him and make our abode with him Jesus wears I see abona mado abona ahom nanya oge debe iwum nnam ga hokwa nanya do you now see that Jesus is looking for a family that will love him so that he can become a member of that family? Jesus is looking for somebody that will love him so that he will come to that person and have relationship with him. Continual relationship. Jesus ne la ya na cho si ke mmadu ahu nke ga esori nke ga ho ya na ya ko bata ni imunya ke ya na malite imwezi mekorita obuki nke na di nwa mbenta kama nke ga adiri we gaba hence the grace of god is the free love of god available for everyone ya mere amara chineke bu ihu na anya nke chineke ana aku gi mmiri ana enye na efu diri onye obula nke ga acho ke ya nara if you don't know it before know it now that god is looking for you to love you he wants to love you freely because he created you so that he will love you if you make up your mind today to obey God's word to turn away from your sins and keep God's word and be following it you have entered into the ocean of everlasting love the grace of God has appeared to all men which the grace of God here means the free forgiveness of God there are sinners in the world and God is looking for a sinner that he will forgive he is looking for someone who has committed sin and wants forgiveness he is looking for such one to bestow free forgiveness for Jesus ne le yare anya buruburu we na acho onya obu onye mehe onu ntu onye nke ike guguru na mehe ya ocho ka agba gari ana efugi e ihe obula it's just like a great man a rich man went to prison and was asking the prison warder is there any here any person here who is in prison because he was not able to pay any money he had he owed so much debt they imprisoned him because of money he could not pay i want to pay the pay it for that person so please go to the prison and be asking the, the inmates there be asking them one by one is there anybody who is in this prison because he couldn't pay some money he was brought to court and because he could have no money he was he is now in prison please check up if anybody is there like that let him come i want to pay i want to pay for him i want to set him free God is looking for someone to forgive. Someone that is guilty of sin. He committed the sin even today. Tell that person that God is looking for her to forgive her. If you are the one hearing me now, if you are the one before me now, you are welcome. God has been looking for somebody to forgive. Thank God you are here. God will forgive your sins. 
Mapuro ni mumadi dota ele rani ne ba ne tichani. Mapuro ni no no logi mabu no da hagi. We na amuwa i. E obri kai ne kumake. Jesus chorokwa ba rage na ba ne obiyoti. The grace of God. Amara chineke. Free forgiveness from God. Kena ba rara ne vege go. Grace of God. Amara chineke. Free forgiveness of God. Na ba rara ne fu. Available for all sinners. All the way ni ndi me henile. Available for your love. All the way ni ndogi. Take it freely. Where are you now? Do you know what it means by forgiveness of sins? It means removing sin from somebody's life. It means canceling the penalty of sin that person is supposed to suffer. That is what it means. Removing sin from your life. So that sin is no more in your life. That thing, that thing making you to do it will not be there again. Taking away the power of sin from your life. Forgiveness of sin. It means changing your taste of sin your hunger for sin that thing that makes you want sin will be removed as i think i had to be a, a, a smoker that was saying i am bound to this cigarette i don't know what to do to stop it i, I, I have tried all my my best, I cannot stop it. Then a, a preacher preached to him about this forgiveness of God. If you will give your life to Jesus, the Lord will take away sin from you. The man wondered, is there any miracle in the earth that will make me stop smoking? Then I'm ready to give my life to Jesus. Yes, Jesus. Yes, now the preacher prayed with him. The preacher prayed with him and committed him to Jesus. Do you know the man wanted to test really what is this thing that the preacher has done? Is there any miracle like that? He lighted a, 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 a cigarette to bring to his mouth. He started vomiting everything that was his installment. Because the power of secret, the love of secret, the taste of secret is removed from his life. God is looking for a sinner to forgive. Jesus God is looking for an adulterer to forgive her sins. God is looking for fornicators, those who are, they cannot do without women. He wants to forgive them. Jesus na cho umwo ke no mwa hinde baba na baka ndo ga bara me God is looking for a drunkard to forgive her forgive him ana cho onya nguru ma o ga bara me God is look I'm telling you he's looking for you ana cho gi why are you still in your sin Ginik na riji na gbe me he did he hear that God is forgiving sin on the inu bagara chile ke na bara me you have never come to God for forgiveness all this while e doku ta bagya ka ba ara gi obo chinde anile you are going to church your sins are still there in a je church man e ka bi na me he the preacher doesn't know the truth about God abo no nyi me ku sa so ma gi yesu ku ba ka chine the preacher didn't tell you what God can do for you abo ro gi ye chine ke prima ni mandogi okay the preacher never told you but i'm telling you now something will happen to you today. I said something will happen to your life today. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. The grace of God has appeared to all men. The grace of God has appeared to all men in John chapter 1 now first John, John, first John chapter 1 John, in chapter 1 verse 9 I'm telling you what God is ready to do for you it says if we confess our sins he is faithful and just to forgive us our sins and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. I say, Oh, Purunahige Kuputa Mehani. 
Iyo uwe ya kusiri nitu kwa siobi Ibo ya nanyimbo ya nile Oga asata kwa ye po Nade ya cha nile All the Lord wants you come and tell me the sin Ya kwa mbe ya What sin is troubling you, my dear? I will forgive you. I will remove it out of your life. I will cleanse all the righteousness from your life. I'm going to do it freely. Everybody say, the, the grace of God. The grace of God means the healing and deliverance of God. God is looking for people who are oppressed and possessed by Satan so that he can deliver them and give them freedom. She is aware of the wickedly Satan is doing. He once asked Satan, Where are you from? Said, I am from going up and down upon the earth. Doing what? Oppressing people. Putting people in bondage. Rendering people under captivity. Ah. Mm -hmm. Then the Lord said, Has Satan come on your way? Is Satan oppressing anybody here? I want to deliver such a person. I would deliver him freely. I will deliver him fully. I will set her free. Is there anybody Satan is making you not to sleep well in your house? Is there anybody Satan is torturing your life? The grace of God. The grace of God. The grace of God. Has appeared to you today. The grace of God. The deliverance of God. The power of God. Has appeared to you today. To lose you. To lose you. To deliver you. To break your yoke. To set you free. The grace of God. That bringing the deliverance has appeared to all men. The grace of God. Because Satan carries some people to secret societies and lock them there. Satan carries some people to witchcraft and closed door against them. He carried a man. The psalmist said he was the one. He carried him and put him in down into a deep ditch. Into a very and the pit has miry clay. And make the man's feet to stuck on the clay. You hope anymore. Has Satan carry you inside there? The voice of God is calling. Is there anybody locked up anywhere? Is there anybody inside any house? Locked up in the house? Is there anybody on the pit? In the dark pit? Is there anybody carried to the top of a tree? Is there anybody lifted up on top of a mountain? He cannot come back. Anybody cry up? Cry up? Anybody where? Can I hear your voice? I want to bring you out. I want to pull you out. I want to deliver you. I want to break your yoke. I want to lift you up. I want to create a way for the life. The grace of God. 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 Has appeared to all very free. Very free. You will never pay. 
you will never labor. He will do it. He okay. said, is there sickness anywhere? Oh, because the world is a dangerous world. Ah, Even from the smoke, from the in industrial smoke in the sky. Okay. You can smell some things and become sick. From this bad water that you drink, you can become sick. From even those that hate you can poison you. There's some even sickness you inherit from your parents. But any man of sickness, any man of disease, the grace of God. Everybody say the grace of God. Yeah. Say it again. The grace of God. Yeah. Free healing. I say free healing. Are you there? In Will, do you want this free healing? The Lord wants to give you. In the book of Psalm 103. From verse 1. Psalm 103. Verse 1. 1 to verse 4. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. Gozi Jehovah, Mburobum, Gozi Kwa Ahansoya. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and forget not all his benefits. Gozi Jehovah, Mburobum, Echeza Kwa Lamesa Amaya Nile. Who forgiveth all thine iniquities? Onye Nabara, Ajomu, Megi Nile. Who healeth all thy diseases? Onye Nabon, Rian, Riagi Nile. Who redeemeth thy life from destruction? Who crowned thee with loving kindness and tender mercy? Can you see what the Lord can, is doing now? As God forgives freely, He heals freely. He is healing freely. No payment of money. The oppression that you would have gone to, he settles it no trouble. Your eyes that were blind, you couldn't see, he opens them without difficulty. Your body that is barren, you cannot give birth to children, he opens it and makes you fruitful. Freely. I said freely. Nefu. I said freely. Nefu. The, the grace of God that bringeth healing has appeared to all men. Yes. In the book of Psalm. Abraham. I read Psalm 50 verse 15. Psalm 50 verse 15. And call upon me in the day of trouble. I will deliver thee and thou shalt glorify me. What are you to do? Call upon him. In your pain, call upon him. Call upon him. In your confusion, call upon him. Now, In your captivity, call upon him. In your oppression, call upon him. In your sickness, call upon him. He promises you deliverance. The grace of God that bringeth salvation has appeared to all men. The grace of God that bringeth salvation. What is this grace of God? It is talking about the goodness of God. The kindness of God. God is good. God is looking for someone to do him good. Is that person here? Please, 
Ask them whether he's here. Be Tonya on Eba. Ask whether she is here. Oh, 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 yeah, I said, God is looking for someone to do her good. Yeah. The good news of the Lord is coming upon your life. Yeah. The Lord is coming upon your life. Yeah. The good news of the Lord is coming upon your life. The good news of the Lord is coming upon your life. This is God. You know when Jonathan died. On a man, Jonathan Moore. David loved Jonathan. David loved Jonathan. Because David loved Jonathan. He came and said, Is there any of the house of Saul? I will reward him. I will do him good. For Jonathan's sake. David was Saul. Jonathan. Because Jonathan loved me. Me and Jonathan Horonanya. And I made a promise to Jonathan. Emperor Jonathan Uncle. He made a promise to me. You will have that we shall live for the good of the our families. In fact, Jonathan made me to swear that in case he died, I should take care of his family. I should show kindness to his children. Is there any of the child, any of the house of Saul, of the children of Jonathan alive, that I may do him good for Jonathan's sake? Jonathan. Not for his sake, but for Jonathan's sake. Go and look for him. Go and make a sake. Then they got a crippled man. A wretched or poor one, young girl. Me feel bushes. Ah, hey, I have me feel bushes. Do you know how crippled people look like? Eh, my God, don't they matter? People who are dragging on the ground. Ndi ana jike na puna. What type of neatness would they have in their body? Kedu ti omi kwa kwenye wano. What type of glory do they have in their body? Kedu ti ebu be denando ha. Crippled man. One young girl. We have found man. One. Eh, we are out one year chatara. One of the sons of Jonathan is alive. Oh, to what Jonathan can then do? His name is Mephibosheth. Ah, I have Mephibosheth. But he's he's a lame man. Come and walk up around Goro. Go and bring Mephibosheth. That but I am not going to order and go. I will do him good. I got the name of him for Jonathan say. Me he Jonathan. Mephibosheth shall be lifted up to sit with me on the table to eat food in the king's palace. For Jesus sake, for Jesus sake, the Lord will do Jesus loved me. He, he, he gave himself. Oh, well, 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 well. He asked for, the, for, for me. Oh, him that I might be satisfied. Is there anybody here? That for the sake of Jesus. Me, he, Jesus. I can do him good. Let that person raise up his hand. Let that person raise up her hand. I command the blessings of God upon your life. I command the goodness of the Lord upon your life. I want to see what you can even do. Jesus said, Receive. Jesus, Maria. For Jesus said, Let the Father pour it upon your life. Me, Jesus, only why we say, Amen to give. The grace of God. Mephibosheth, you are in the king's palace. You are rolling your leg there. Everybody will accept you. The Lord will accept you. I said, for Jesus' sake, whatever is your sin, the Lord will forgive it. Me, Jesus. The grace of God that brings salvation. The grace of God that bring it the goodness of God. That bring it the 
kindness of God is on top of every man. It's on top of every woman. Shake it on your head. <laughs> free, free, free. It's descending upon you. It's descending upon you. The goodness of the Lord because of his kindness. Because of his tender mercy. Something is coming to you. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. It means the grace of God is the blessing of God. It is the blessing of God. In the book of Numbers, chapter 6, Numbers, chapter 6, ECC, verse 27, 23 to 27. The Bible says, 23, Speak unto Aaron and say to his sons, On this wise ye shall bless the children of Israel, saying unto them, Well, in the we're in the presence of God. I know Grace is coming on you. I say grace is coming on you. We are in the presence of God. You will receive grace. You just be saying amen. Are you hearing me? Something good is going to happen today. Hallelujah. Amen. Saying unto them, when I say, the Lord bless you. The Lord keep you. May the Lord make his face to shine upon your life. May the Lord be gracious. Be gracious. Do it freely upon you. Give you freely. Touch you freely. Deliver you freely. Serve you freely. May the Lord lift up his shining face over your life. As Queen Esther appeared before King Ahasuerus and he stretched up the staff of acceptance. May the God of heaven stretch up his staff of acceptance to your life. May the Lord give you peace. The difficulty of your life comes to an end. May, may the Lord give you peaceful sleep. May the Lord open the door for your life. Is this not grace? When you were coming today, did you know what was going to happen to you? It has happened. I said, now it has happened. Oh, now it has happened. Oh, my God. Hallelujah. The grace of God. Amarachinake. The grace of God. Amarachinake. Yes. Eh. The grace of God means the call of God for service. Eh, Amarachinake Potara. Opubonke Chineke. Maki Jereosi. Not by the education of your life. Abogini Hoka Gumagogi. Not by how much English you can speak. Not by any experience of your life. The Lord just is saying, come, I have chosen you. I have chosen to honor you. It's like Amos said, I was neither a prophet nor the son of prophet, a prophet. I was a gatherer of sacrament fruits. 
But the Lord called me. And gave me his spirit. Receive. In the name of Jesus. Let the call of God come upon your life. Let the anointing of God come upon your life. Let the Lord give you a ministry. Let your, the Lord open your eyes to see great things. And old woman like you, but God has chosen you. A young person like you, but God has chosen you. Let this grace. I said, this is great. The grace of God. The goodness of God. Has appeared to all men. Amen. Amen. The grace of God. What does it mean? It means the gift of heaven. The gift of heaven. Free. Free. Free Nef has come to you. Free Nef has come to you. I said, Free Nef. We remember a man or the Nutai in that prayer and effort came on him at his dying time. I just better wear Saya Homona Choyung and it spoke to him. Even when he could not speak again, he was just hearing with the hearing of the ear. And consented, I have agreed. Here. And he died. He said, ah, It's as if they pushed me to heaven. I said, I will take you there. Yeah. Free gift. Free gift. As a free gift. Receive. In the book of Luke. Now, Luke. Luke chapter 12. Luke. He's in Verse 32. Fear not, little flock. It is your father's good pleasure to give you the kingdom. It is your father's good pleasure to give you the kingdom. Fear the devil has been tormenting your fear. The Lord said, I have given you heaven already. You will be there. I, I have seen your labor. I have seen your commitment. If the, the thief that is on the cross just prayed for less than one minute, Lord, remember me when thou comest into thy father's kingdom. And God answer your prayers for all this period. Your prayers for all this period. The gate, the gate of heaven is open. God is looking for people to make them enter into heaven. Do you know how many demons left heaven? How many precious, glorious, great angels that fell from heaven with Lucifer? The, the, and Jesus said, I go to prepare a place. Jesus said, There is enough room. There is enough room. In fact, Jesus took someone to heaven and said, Look at mansions. Jesus, they are even for some people, but they missed it and have gone to heaven. A place is for you. You will enter that place. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow you. Oh, 
all the days all the days of your life my sister show me goodness and mercy shall fall oh no you brother all the days of the days of your life and you shall dwell in the house of the lord forever my voice has finished can you take, take it i'm talking about your heaven i, I am talking that. about your heaven you will be there. i say you will be there you will be there that's the grace of God. God is not a liar. It's not in man that he shall lie. It's not the son of man that he shall repent. Is he poking it and shall he not do it? Let's go to the book of Titus again. Chapter 2, verse 11. For the grace of God that bringeth salvation hath appeared to all men, teaching us that denying ungodliness and worldly lusts, we should live soberly, righteously, and godly in this present world. <laughs> Verse 13. Looking for that blessed hope and the glorious appearing of the great God and our Savior Jesus Christ. Now, God is speaking to people who have received the grace of God. Paul, the apostle, received the grace of God. The grace of God unto forgiveness. The grace of God unto righteousness. The grace of God unto apostolic calling. And he said, I frustrated not the grace of God. Yes, I frustrate not the grace of God. So the Lord is saying, Don't you who have received this grace, don't frustrate the grace. Of God. That's why the grace of God is telling us deny ungodliness you who have expected received the grace of God deny ungodliness you who want the grace of God deny ungodliness ungodliness is every kind of sinful and evil life reject them reject reject sinful life reject a wicked life reject evil life by things you do that are evil don't do them again things that you say that are evil don't say them again because of the grace of god you have received because of the grace of god you desire in the book of first corinthians chapter six ECC. First Corinthians chapter 6. Corinthians Kembo ECC. I read from verse 9. To verse 11. Know ye not that the unrighteous shall not inherit the kingdom of God? That's the question. Don't you know that if you turn to unrighteousness, you will not receive the king, you will not inherit the kingdom of God again? Then 
be not deceived neither fornicators no idolaters ebola ke tu hege ndi na kwito na ndi na ebere arusi no adulterers mo bundi nurudi na huya kama kwa gariko no effeminate mo bundi ngote na emo wa ka nwanyi no abusers of themselves with mankind homosexual ma ndi ngote na kwa garita wa ete hibe na omo wanyi na kwa nwanyi be hiko no thieves mo bundi ori no covetous mo ndi anyuku no drunkard mo bundi anroma no revilers all those who are quarrelsome no ndi okoriri no extortioners no ndi na mara king bribe ndi nke na mara kazu shall inherit the kingdom ha ga ga ke ta na ze chineke the grace of god for every heaven has freely up come upon you amara nke chineke ma ke te libe adaba so wogi be careful no zonya Don't listen to those people that say you can still be in the grace of God but you can sin and still God will still uh, you won't have God won't have no problem. Eh kwenye kwarande ana do achonye ha ga do this. Eh in in ataka amara chineke imemme he was in help tara. Don't listen to those people who say once you are saved you are ever saved they are liars. Eh kwarande ana say aso buta ga aso buta ta gogi i yo so kwara ga ike jere re enugo. Bible said don't allow any church any preacher to deceive you our process e ko kwara ka o ko chipo obo na ma obu zu ko obo na do hege yes mm. don't allow anyone's any such to deceive you e ko na ka onye ozi obo la we do hege if you are a fornicator you have missed it e buru onye oku iko iga ye ru eligbe if you are going after me going after women Yes you have missed it. Ina tuari mu oke na tuari mu wanyi eligwe akwa alade. You are an idol worshipper. Ibu onye na ekere arusi. You go to this harbor list to collect charm. E ga kuru nde di anya nzu ka ha bo oro gogo. You go to this wish doctors and are collecting things to to drink and to put in your pocket to put in your body. E ga kuru nde ndasi enye gi nke ga nwo no na nke ga afonye na aba. You are going to collect charm to help you succeed. Ina gana rogu ai je ji me ke ga ni ru you are going to collect charm to make you have power ina ga ina rogu je ji wuru tike you are going to collect power from satan to defend yourself e gana rogu si ke je ji we na chere wogi you are collecting power from satan to attack people ina na rogu si ke ki we me me sam di mad at am kojo kingdom has been closed against you ma na e me chi bu dogo wa mu ze ni gbe you have frustrated the grace of god e ba bu ela amara nke chi ni ke you have frustrated the grace of god ibabuela amaranke chineke the bible says grief not the holy spirit how can so see emenyu kwalam adasile mo so chineke we bible says quench not the spirit how can so see emenyu kwalam mo so by this character you will quench the spirit of grace zitena abarama abade oto ige emenyu mo nka amara that's to the word of god nka bo ku chineke serving idol ibarose going into witchcraft even amus all this free initiation that they're looking for people to initiate and you they initiate you into witchcraft and you do not cry out to to be delivered heaven has been closed against you o tu an e se enye ndi mada amus an e rigere amus ebe ni ne tiembu ka aso pota ka obo ni me chi on e ma na onu se ni ko e me chi bu dugu we are in time in which men are behaving like women i know in obo nke mu wo ke na e me ka mu an they dress like women Han he yin akomo wa they played their hair weke isi komo wa as a woman be come on heaven has been close against those people ndi bi oto a eligbe me ti goro ho so if you were god gave you grace chine kenye ga amara the creator says i will love you i will come into your house i will come into your life and i will live with you there onye kero wa sin agama abokuta ya agama bata ni mendo gi muna ge be ka obu eburenyi and you are going to bring strange and dirty thing to your life e chokwa ki wo buta ihe roro aro na ihe na ama ge be sin mendo gi he will leave you oga ha pogi you have backslidden a man ain't up going to you have frustrated the way of god and he may go also chineke that's what he said ka ka na eku what about what about thieves ke ma kan do si homosexual ndi mo ke na ku be hiko or people who are caught money has overtaken you monti e go back agori si you want this you want that you want that so god, you don't even have time for god again 
Business has so taken you that no time to serve this goal. You are pursuing money, the love of money is the root of all evil. And because of money, you are doing many atrocities, many wicked things. Grace of God has been frustrated. You are taking bribes. Or giving bribes. The grace of God has been frustrated. That's the word of God. And it means you will not inherit the kingdom of God. You won't go there anymore. That's why the Bible says. Deny ungodliness. Deny, reject ungodliness. Not only ungodliness, but it says deny worldly loss. Worldly things. Worldly desires. Those desires that are coming to you, do like this. Do like, say no. First John chapter 2 verse 15 to 17 Love not the world neither the things that are in the world if any man love the world the love of the father is not in him for all that is in the world the lust of the flesh and the lust of the eye and the pride of life is not of the father but it's of the world and the world passeth away and the lust thereof. But he that doeth the will of God abided forever. Love not the world. Deny worldly lust. Yes, reject them. Don't give, don't appreciate the way the people of the world dress themselves. You see the bobbing style of these rough boys on the street. Some of them are ministers of the gospel, they call themselves. With funny hairdo. Pong, 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 J5, pong hair. Obara J5. And they do many things. Some leave it on in the front. Deny it. Reject it. Worldly lie. People call them by names because of how they dress. Don't join them. These boys that leave their pants outside, in our words. Don't join them. The grace of God unto divine love has come that God wants to love you. Don't join those evil people. Don't. Don't join them. All this evil bobbing style. Don't. We we soldier. We What about this present tight trousers? Some boys use. Yes, you be wondering how they're pulling it out. I think they lie as an operation base. And allow another man to be pulled out. It's dirty before God. It's demonic. Your trousers have proper proper balance. Proper length. They're not worldly trousers. Or wearing tight fitting shades. Don't open your chest. Let the women see. The Bible says it's not of God. It's not of the Father. It is of the world. What do we say of women? Your, your palming. 
is not of the father they attach me and the wool you put on they do these things for fashion the, the fashion of this world passes away. Don't join them. The evil here do of women. Painting your body. Painting your face. Wearing earrings. Hanging three of them. In one ear. And some boys put one in, the, in their one ear. You see them in the television. They are of the world. Doom to hell. You were doing them before. But God figured you out and forgave you. Don't go back to those things. Woman, don't be given to dressing. You want to be flamboyant. All these shining stones that you turn like that, the stones are making shining as if they are whatever. I did, I, did, I did the glory of God. Uh, they are reflecting the glory of the world. And they are in uniform of harlots. They are the dressing of harlots. So don't do them. The Bible says, deny worldly lusts. All this dancing. Stylish dancing. Reject it. Don't dance to please your flesh. Refuse pride. Demonstration of pride. When people are among their colleagues, they want to show off. Don't join them. You have received the grace of God. The grace of God unto forgiveness. The grace of God for heaven has come to you. Reject those things. That's the word of God. But you should live soberly. What does it mean then? It means live a life different from your former lifestyle. Your present life now that you have received mercy, you have received the goodness of God, you have received the kindness of God, you have received the presence of God. Your present life now should be of a new creature. If any man is in Christ, he's a new creature. Live righteously. Live in the fear of God. Keep the commandments of God. Associate with the righteous. First John chapter one, verse five to seven. First John chapter one, verse five to seven. This then is the message which we have heard of him, and declare unto you that. God is light. And in him is no darkness at all. If we say that we have fellowship with him. And walk in darkness. We lie and do not the truth. But if we walk in the light. As he is in the law. We have fellowship one with another. And the blood of Jesus Christ, his son, cleanses us from all sin. That's the word of God. Let's come together. Come to a true fellowship of Christians. Not where you're jumping up, jumping up, there's no righteousness there. It's not where they give you anointing oil to drink uh, and pour it upon your body and you have not changed. It's 
It's not where they give you promise. You God will do like this. God will do like this. And you're saying amen, amen, but it's a lie. God be blessing those who frustrate his grace can God be blessing those who deny his grace those who reject him can he bless them those who are not interested in him can he bless them so Associate with righteous people. Come into fellowship with people that know God. That can preach his word correctly. And that can live the exemplary life. It is not the, the name any church has gotten. Ah, this is everybody knows this church in the world. Ah, There's no name that says but Jesus. In any church, where righteousness and truth are being preached and practicalized, God is among them. God, God is not inheritance of any de denomination. God for he said, far be it. He that he that loves me, I will love. But he that draws away from me, I will draw away from him. That's the word telling you. Live godly. You be needing so demonstrate practical righteousness before all men go see with joy and gladness as one that has received the grace of god in the book of matthew I read chapter 5. Verse 14 to 16. Ye are the light of the world. A city that is set on an hill cannot be hid. Neither do men light a candle and put it under a bushel. But on a candlestick. That it that it giveth light unto all that are in the house. Let your light so shine before men that they may see your good works and glorify your Father which is in heaven. Let the people see your new life. Let your, the people see that you are a new creature. A young man who gave his life to Jesus was going somewhere. A, one of these women that he was sleeping with, a man's wife, was calling, hey, hey, he listen. Hey, hey, I've changed. I've changed. I've changed. I've changed. I've changed. Tell your friends you have changed. Tell those customers you have changed. You have received the grace of God. You have received the grace of God. Your sins have been forgiven. Your life has been changed. The key of heaven has been given to you. Are you going to play again with them? Hey, hey, come, let's go down. I'm not going in there. I have changed. I can't join you again. I was the one leading you, but I have changed. I was leading you to hellfire. And now I'm going to lead people to heaven. The grace of God. Everybody said the grace of God. Looking for the appearing of Jesus. Nature of Jesus. Be rapture ready. I want to tell you that those whose ears are open to truth are now straightened. They are in a kind of attention because Jesus is already on the way. 
ndi anime nte na yero ye ndi na batakoro ezoku hani ne na nji kere na echere ni na jesus no no so onwere ike wucha mbobula when rainy season is approaching you know mbe oge meme di che na bia ikosirima when the rain is coming you there are those who study the sky they know who do miri na bia ma miri chorizo enanya na mbarigwe igama na miri chorizo there are weather forecasters that will tell you a shining in the evening although it's a bright sky as you're seeing a shining in the evening ondi na ho maka ongo kanke o onwa na ihe ile ga sige na miri gezo na mbe de echi obweze na nwe echo ga oru na mbe miri gezo it shall rain tomorrow ok miri gezo echi i'm telling you all spiritual experts those the lord communicates with have let us know the rapture the coming of jesus is just very close some are thinking do we need to bother ourselves thinking to labor and be building house can we finish the house before jesus will come a child going to school was wondering i'm not sure i will finish my school before jesus will come are you hearing what i'm saying because of this how we feel it in our life because of what we see the world is doing the preacher is already on the wall for 666 great work is going on to unify the world into one Getting ready for the Antichrist to come and rule free. Now, the Christ, we The king, we look at Israel, we see that uh, Israel has gotten over Jerusalem, remaining the temple to build, and then it is that temple Antichrist are coming there. The thing, the thing is finished, my brother, my sister. The is Israel ready? Israel, we have the Israel, we are going to Jerusalem. Abu Manizi, Iru Uno, Uno Uno, Abu Uno Uno, Saka, Anti Christ, Gaba, Ta Wemero, Ieni Ines Gope, Gini Oza Chumeche, Be Rapture Ready. Wado Makan Wolim Ninsa. Now, be zealous of good works. Wano Uno Uno, Be Irezo Lomile. In the book of Titus. Now, who called Titus? Chapter 2. Isi Abu verse 14 Titus chapter 2 verse 14 Titus who gave himself for us that he might redeem us from all iniquity and purify unto himself a peculiar people zealous of good works Onye mekola ko onya doro onya nso meka ayi we buru ndige enwe onu noku iru esolo nine can you see the ultimate ehho nke kacha si we want the grace of god appear to achieve in your life mbe e mara chine ke putara ni mbe ni abi yo kosere mo in this present world nando adi wa angels are busy in heaven there are those who come down to keep duty on earth but do you know what the grace of God has been done in your life to make you clean clean and zealous of good works to put this to make you worthy to serve Jesus Jesus make you worthy to serve the Lord to make you zealous go up and down as angels are in heaven so we are on earth busy up and down serving the Lord that which where you too full of this earth that is passing away to the point that you cannot do something for Jesus you cannot do anything for Jesus. You're be, people, you're supposed to be busy. See how we are busy now? 
how we are here we're going to onisha tomorrow we're going to prepare visa to go outside the country we're traveling busy for jesus because the grace appeared to us and you're sitting down there emrokayo wa si abari nezu ike ai no no katata echi ai je je wonu cha ai je cho onita ai je se ba kwodo iji isu we na mbozo bi chiche ji wo ri tukure ba buru no kite we fe that you are even over a church over a chapter over a unit and you're idle you're doing nothing na unit na chapter na kwa church e bino ibura na kiti e wefe o nwe na alu did you really receive the grace of god e na tara mara chile kemo zia did you receive grace unto forgiveness e na tara mara nke mba ara mbe did you receive the grace of god e na tara mara chile ke grace unto deliverance a mara rue na na pota grace unto holiness a mara rue ni di so and you are sitting down you are to kuro to be doing nothing you are in a mess for this jesus that is coming maka jesus say na be o yin am crying because the world has forsaken him all the thing do no wa bakutari as you sit down there in your house you are to kuro no lagi you are moving freely in this land e mo yin wa na chori me your money nothing is going out there you are not using it for go abage adege je bi tinu kuro you are doing nothing o mo yin ji de mere your neighbors have never heard the people around have never heard from you you're frustrating the grace of god see the ultimate that you should be sinners of good works engage yourself in good works for god has saved you for this purpose not not fully your life he got even you mango lazy Oh you know what busy na alusori ke father na no ku sinners of good works no no ku ile solo now we have played the ball to your to you now yeah aya otara lo ko we have given you the sound doctrine anya enye go gi jesus si na nyendo we have given you the sound ministry anya enye go gi jesus si na nyendo presence of god is here for you e ru chile ke de ba ni higi jesus christ has come for you jesus be ni higi are you going to sit idle there I say, will you sit idle there? It is pining the heart of God. We have brought to you this ministry. Let's do what we will do in this ministry. As somebody that has received the grace of God. Let us know what we will do in this ministry. As somebody whose eyes have opened. This is the ministry of God's heart. Kabu ujozi ke bitire ke. It is the ministry of end time revival. Kabu ujozi ke ntupe nko gugoge. People are spending on it. Ndi mmade de wo pete ge ipare. They spend their money on it. Ha na wo pete ge ipare. They spend their time on it. Ha na wo pete ge ipare. They spend their energy on it. Ha na wo pete ge ipare. Sitting idle. We no like the folly past the say we this see this great thing that we we do not well ndu e bente no se e ai ba chenkita ya no yemen ka ma see this privilege we are having we ye ndi ani na abia people are in their churches ndi maru no nzu ka dying because of hell mary na wo ni ye kere mari people are in their churches ndi maru no no nzu ka this is by anointing oil e ji a o to ma no mo no ni ba wo se ha na this is by false prophecies ndi a mo na na edu ya ma you have the word of life you are open to the kingdom of god as open your eyes the lord will guide the four lepers say ndi e be ta na so let us tell the king's household kai ga me ko se aru e bi e sente Hunger is in the city. I go to nobody. But now we have discovered treasure. Where are you? What are you saying? Hunger is in the city. I go to nobody. Everywhere, shut up. Mad me, they are not going to hunt you. Everywhere, shut up. Everybody in the metro, in the city. Preachers have shut up. The condemnation. Even the people who say they are going to hunt you, that Jesus cannot come there. Now Jesus is where he came from. They will not invite people like me to go and scatter their place. Ah, God, when you become a gangster, you say, huh? By bringing the truth to them, you will turn heads up. And causing people to run out for their lives. How they make a woman say that about them? They have locked up that place. How they put you in a bag? But the members are living near you. Man, I have been out to get the members. 
are your neighbor. The members are your relation. God wants you to be zealous. I said God wants you to be zealous. You will jump to this ministry. When the woman of Samaria came at Jesus. And got this Jesus. Oh, Jesus, sir. He said, eh? Huh? Yeah, the ah, I'll do it. What I say here? What I stay here? I'm going to tell the people in the city. Come and see him. Out. The piano for you that told me everything that I did. Why am I heading to Kemba? It's the Messiah. Oh, be the Messiah. You have been waiting for. Oh, yeah, I need to make Go be publish this ministry. Who say Josiah? Go and give testimony about holiness movement. Go and say Maka. It is a holiness ministry of end time. Go be Josiah. Go be going around the world. Who are you about to be fighting the church righteousness? Now make a new committee to not change. You are a sinner from the power of Satan. Now make a new make. I am not going to make you carry the books and go forward with them. The books move forward with them because Sorrow Daniel carry the CDs. Buru and Josiah. They are recording them there. Osa ini ya di kono. Where will we go? How we get ahead? Use your money. Where it is going? Use your time. Did you get it? Copy. So now your God will say, "Well done, thou good and faithful servant." Sine kega si ime na ezimwam gi onye oru kusrenti kusobi. Receive zeal. Nara ruda kum. Receive zeal. Nara ruda kum. Receive the zeal of the Lord. Nara ruda kum tachi neke. Let the zeal of the Lord shake your life. Kano ruda kum tachi neke. Parari ando the zealous of preaching. Zealous to give them money for Jesus. Zealous to sponsor the movement. Zealous of good work. Zealous of good work. A daughter of this land. Living in Israel, Nana by Israel, sent more than a million naira for this group. Sinners of good works. Onu no kuma kime so we make sure the work of Jesus reaches you. Iwo no oso man ka leza irinte. Oka is my land. Oka buben na me. People must do this thing. Ha ga ya go kumo. She said, "Please tell me how much you need to go to Oka." Because mommy, your girl, you can do Oka. Silas of good work. I don't know who you are. I see you guys are sincere. Nara, I don't know who you will sit like that. A girl on a court in a room, you release your money. The coordinator of this place was telling me the difficulty they are facing in this land. Oh, coordinator, now I'm going to see how I can begin over there. Difficulty. Easy, can even even pass me even to leave. And these are bearers of precious seeds. They have no people to release their money. You will rise up and promise God. God. Chineke. God. Chineke. If I forgive, forget you. If I forget Jesus. Let me die. I have decided now. Every day, I'm going to work. Oka for Jesus. Oka for Jesus. Ibuya for Jesus. Ani ba for Jesus. Nigeria for Jesus. Nigeria for Jesus. Africa for Jesus. Africa for Jesus. The world for Jesus. Ani la for Jesus. Rise up upon your feet. Tonye no kuga. Jesus of good works. Anu no kui we say no mi. Jesus of good works. Anu no kui we say no mi. Jesus of good works. Anu no kui we say no mi. No. Who is God? You will do it. We chile kampani gema. You will do it. Ni gema ya. You will do it. Ni gema ya. Why should people die and you are here? And the matter now we have been ever. Why should people die? And you will hang on a jam where you never. Why should the gospel of Jesus die and your head? Don't say my guess you will be never. Zealous of good works. I don't know if you will say no. Zealous of good works. I don't know if you will say no. The grace of God. I'm a ratchineke. The grace of God. I'm a ratchineke. Is moving in this land. Now I got to know better to serve people. The grace of God is moving in Ibo now. To serve people. The grace of God is moving in Nigeria. Nigeria. To serve people. The grace of God is moving in Africa. Nigeria in Africa. To serve people. The grace of God is moving in the world. To serve people. But we need zealous men. I am the man. 
zealous women. 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 Is that the prayer you're praying when I say you should pray with zeal? Zeal is the prayer Don't frustrate the grace of God that has appeared to all men. Don't frustrate the grace of God that has, has appeared to all men. Go for it. Go for it. Release your resources for it. Release your resources for it. Create them for evangelism with the gospel. Sponsor others for evangelism. Jesus. of God. The grace of God. The goodness of the Lord. The kindness of the Lord. The forgiveness of the Lord. The blessings of the Lord. The callings of the Lord. The gift of heaven by God has appeared to you. Has appeared to your brother. Has appeared to your sister. Has appeared to your family. They need the gospel. Reject ungodliness. Do as a Live righteously. Reject ungodliness. Banari as a Live righteously. When do Edinsa live righteously? When do Nelson in Jesus' name we pray? And yet, when I had Jesus, God is looking for somebody to forgive. To forgive his sins. Is looking for somebody to forgive her sins. They say, Though your sins are many, I will forgive all. If you are the one, raise up your hand. If you are the one, God will forgive you. Raise up your hand. And come quickly so that I can connect with you. Come forward very quickly. God is looking for somebody to forgive. That secret thing he will forgive you. He is looking for somebody to change. Yes. God is looking for you to forgive you. 
is looking for somebody to love. Somebody that will accept his love so he can love you. As you come, tell God you are the one. Tell him that you are the one. That your sins are serious ones. That you are the one you have come for his forgiveness. Tell him you have come for his forgiveness. He's looking for you. On her talking to him. All those bad language of your life. Ah, you are causing many people to fall into sin. You have been causing quarrel in your family. He said he wants to forgive you. You went, you are sleeping with another woman secretly somewhere. Privately, a man has humbled you somewhere. Anytime you're praying, you feel guilty. Said, I will forgive you. God is looking for somebody to forgive you. Come and I will forgive you. I will forgive you. Tell him now, Lord, forgive me. Repeat this prayer after me. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Forgive me. I am the one. You are looking for. To forgive me. I have come to you Lord Jesus. Forgive me. Remove sin from my life. Remove sin from my life. Oh Lord change me. Put your power in my life so that I will not sin again. Lord Jesus, forgive me. Lord Jesus, forgive me. I won't do it again. I will not go there again. I will not touch that person again. Lord Jesus, I will follow you. I've been neglecting your church, but now, Lord, I will come to your church. Lord Jesus, I need you. Only one Jesus. So don't quote to say it. Only one Jesus. Open Goyah. In Kine Lanya. Apotam Nimigi. Nambanya Sia. Eku Putan. Nabu Goyan Mehe. Bayarajo Mumen Mele. Gosima Maragi. Mere me bere Satan Pana me hemile Epe ngimpa Adagi me Allah chazu nime ha Bawe ngu Wesu gajo me nime Pibua aturu nime Nki hocho Meka mma hiti wago Ntoziye Ngonu makunobi Imezo alo nime Nima Jesus now I'm praying for you. Lord Jesus. Jesus. You died for the sins of these people. You are the love of God to mankind. And these ones have come because the Lord is calling them for forgiveness. I am praying. Forgive them. Jesus. Jesus. Forgive them. Father. Forgive them. Holy Ghost. Forgive them. By the blood of Jesus. Remember the blood of Jesus. Jesus. By the blood of Jesus, forgive them. Lord, change their life. Let them see it in a new way. Let them become new creatures. If any man is in Christ, he is a new creature. Let the power of God change them. 
Remove the devil from their lives. Remove evil spirits from their lives. In Jesus' name we pray. Jesus, I pray. Jesus' name we pray. Jesus, you are forgiven. Go and live a new life. Come to this movement. Holy this revival movement. Brana Obaka Holiness will teach you how to live clean and righteous. I got Kusri Oti Gesi Jide Gani Runi Diso Nesio Mumet. There are areas of your life that need to be perfected, corrected. Or to do so, Dinam, the Lupe Srika has in Koma, I can Yerega can has in Yah, who will teach you the correct word of God. I got Kusri Ukwa and Kana Kogimiri. That will not frustrate the grace you have received today. I told you God is looking for somebody to heal. God is looking for somebody to deliver. Are you the one? You want you say God look at me here. Just raise up your hand before him. God, Lord, I want you to heal me. Lord, I want you to deliver me. I'm going to pray for you. My coordinators, are you not looking for healing and deliverance? You don't have somebody that you say, God, that person there. Our coordinators don't need blessings from God. Uh, Amen. Amen. Raise up your hands there. Something will happen to you today. I said something will happen to you today. Something is happening, is coming upon your life now. The Lord will heal you. The Lord will deliver you. The Lord will give you a blessing. Now open your mouth and tell God what you're looking for. Now tell God what you're looking for. The grace of the Lord shall bring healing and deliverance upon their lives. You will solve their problems. All sicknesses and diseases, God, you will take care of them. All oppressions of the devil, you will take care of them. The blessings these people are looking for, Father, you are going to grant them. Oh Lord, hear prayers. Those outside, those inside, men, women, children. May the Lord see to them. May the Lord look on them. The Lord show them mercy from above. Show them mercy from above. Show them mercy from above. The grace of God. The grace of God. The grace of God. The grace of God. The grace of In Jesus' name we pray. The grace of the Lord that bringeth healing and deliverance has appeared to all men. Telling us the true faith on the Lord Jesus. Now, why is it Jesus? They shall be healed, they shall be delivered. Telling us the true faith in the promises of God. Now, why is it Their needs shall be granted. I stand here this day by the word of God. I declare healing upon this place. I declare healing upon this place. I declare healing upon your body. I declare deliverance from powers of darkness. I declare deliverance from the bondage of the devil. I declare by the power of God. Darkness fly away from their lives. Devil get out from their lives. 
Everything brought by the devil in your life. I destroy it right now in the presence of the Lord in Jesus' name. I command down the fire of God. Devil. Whichever person you say is your daughter. Whichever man you have captured, boy, child, you have captured. I lose them in the name of Jesus. All the powers of witchcraft. The powers of occultism. The power of my water spirit. I destroy them in the name of Jesus. Allah Everyone that is a witch. Everyone in my kingdom. Everyone in occultism. Whatever is the power of their master. I set you free in Jesus' name. All property of witchcraft. In your arm. In your stomach, now for you. In your body, now for I destroy them in Jesus' name. Allah, honey, Allah, Jesus. Let the angels set you free. Can the Moses talking about? Let the angels set you free. Can the Moses talking about? Let you fly away. You spirit of oppression, oppressing these people in dreams, oppressing these people in one way or the other, I bind you, I bind you, I bind you, I bind you. I bind you. I and I break your yokes in the land. I set them free. Be free to serve Jesus in Jesus' name. When I work you for Jesus, so for I have Jesus. All manner of sickness. Already teacher. All manner of disease. Already teacher. I am praying for you. And I'm about you healing. Or who wants to healing? Or who wants to receive? Receive. 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 We see, we see, we see, we see. Let your eyes open. Let your deaf ears open. Let your dumb mouth open. Let your lame legs receive strength. I release your body from every bondage. Miracle, 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 you see, you see, you see, it's coming down from God. Honor, you see, it's coming down from God. It's coming down. Receive them, receive them, receive them, receive them, receive them, receive them, deliverance, miracles. In Jesus' name, we pray. I open the battle room. I strengthen every man's productive system. Those that bet wait, I deliver them. In Jesus name. All those 
those things moving around your body, I destroy them. You are free. Lord, take care. Now, Father, miracle. Financial miracle. Open door of success. Breakthrough. Transformation. God. Blessing. Blessing. Anointing of the Holy Ghost. Receive. 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 Begin to thank the Lord. Begin to thank the Lord. Begin to worship the Lord. Jesus. Jesus. Receive. Receive. Be free. Healed of every sickness. Healed of every pain. Power is in your life now. Jesus. 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 Everybody call that to Jesus. 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 Today, there is a miracle in my life. Today, miracle in your life. Today, today, there is a miracle in my life. I say, miracle in your life. Today, miracle in your life. Today, there is a miracle in my life. I say miracle in your life Miracle in your life Today There is a miracle in my life I say miracle in our life Miracle in our life Miracle in his life There is a miracle in my life Today Miracle has come to you the miracle in your body, miracle in your eyes. That is a miracle in my life. I say miracle in your house, miracle in family, miracle in business. That is a miracle in my life. The miracle in your ministry, the miracle in your ministry, the miracle in your church. That is a miracle in my life. I say miracle in your life Today Miracle in your life Today That is a miracle in my life I say miracle in your body Today Miracle in your ministry Today Hey That is a miracle in my life Today
Since you have just listened to is a production of Holiness Revival Movement Worldwide. Holiness Revival Movement Worldwide is a non-denominational ministry that is given to the propagation of Christ's righteousness and holiness in churches and nations of the world through crusades, revival meetings, production and spread of holiness literature and materials. For other spiritual materials, messages or inquiries, contact us on 0816-902-3948 or 0805 you can also reach us through our email address, Holiness Revival Movement at gmail.com. God bless you. For God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son, that whosoever believes in Him should not perish, but have everlasting life. For God sent not His Son into the world condemn the world, but that the world through him might be saved. Hallelujah. Jesus, I believe in you. You are my Lord and Savior. I believe Savior. Jesus, I, I believe. believe.
Jesus, I believe. 